Welcome to A and M Awesome Animals. Hello, everyone. Today I'll be traveling to Germany and talking about the American Eskimo. Please don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for future weekly videos. The American Eskimo dog, or Eski, is actually not from America. They originated in Germany and descended from the German Spitz. The dogs that would become the American Eskimo dog came to the United States with their German immigrant owners. When they were brought to the United States, they became popular as family pets. Despite what their name might suggest, Eskies were never bred to be sled dogs. They do, however, excel at agility competitions. They used to be herders and guard dogs. The American Eskimo is a family dog. Eskies are very loyal and need to be around their owners. They are highly intelligent but can be stubborn. They make good watchdogs but are prone to excessive barking. American Eskimos are prone to leg calf parthes disease, hip dysplasia, juvenile cataracts, and progressive retinal atrophy. The American Kennel Club recognizes three sizes, toy, miniature, and standard. Toy is from 9 inches to 12 inches, miniature from 12 to 15 inches, and standard from 15 to 19 inches. In the late 19th century, the American Eskimo dog became popular with traveling circuses. They were easily trainable and capable of performing entertaining agility stunts. Their bright white coats also looked great in the spotlight. It was the circus that made the American Eskimo dog extremely popular as a family pet. If there was one breed capable of becoming an acrobat, it would be the American Eskimo dog. An Eski was the first dog known to ever walk a tightrope. Today, Eskies are still known for the wide variety of tricks they can perform. Like the Poodle, the American Eskimo dog comes in three sizes, standard, miniature, and toy. The standard, though, usually weighs no more than 35 pounds. Just when you think these dogs can't get any cuter, you find out that they come in biscuit color. All Eskies are either completely white or white with biscuit cream, according to the official breed standard. That means an Eski should have a mostly white coat with biscuit colored fur around the edges. The American Eskimo dog was initially the German Spitz. However, after World War II, it got renamed as American Eskimo dog after being introduced in the United States. As this dog is known throughout the world, it is also bred in households and by many different breeders. So the exact number of American Eskimos all across the globe is unknown. But we can estimate that the number is pretty high and steadily increasing owing to its popularity and excellent personality, behavior, and traits. Owing to a very active lifestyle that involves loads of running and exercise, the American Eskimo dog suffers from fewer health issues, problems, and diseases. One of the diseases which this dog can get is progressive retinal atrophy. As a result, their normal life expectancy increases manifold in comparison with other dogs. This breed has an average lifespan of around 13 to 15 years. The usual diet of a dog depends on the breed along with other factors like size, activity, and age status. The average food that should be given to an American Eskimo dog should be high quality dried dog food approximately around 1.5 cups divided equally into two different meals during the day. Dry dog food usually consists of 25% quality protein along with a minimum of 10% good fat with equally fine fiber quantity so that the digestion is perfect. Since this is a very active dog, there is a little chance of it being overweight. However, obesity is very common among dogs and thus should be kept checked regularly. Hypoallergenic means something or substance that can cause very little allergic reactions. As for the case of the American Eskimo dog, no these dogs are not hypoallergenic at all. However, anyone be it elders or little children with milder allergies can mix with this breed without having to worry. Proper and adequate grooming is a must for Eskies. Since they shed a lot, they should be brushed regularly. As for the bathing schedule, they should be given a bath at least once every couple of months. American Eskimo dogs can be kept in all types of homes and apartments, but it requires regular walks and exercises outside the house. It likes to play in the snow and water and doesn't like to spend time on its own. American Eskimo dogs should be provided with plenty of toys because it likes to chew things. It requires lots of attention and likes to participate in everyday activities with its family. American Eskimo dogs are very vocal and often bark, yowls, and produce mumbling sounds. If you've enjoyed this video, please smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for future weekly videos. See you guys next time, good! Bye!